out of YouTube. Today we're taking a look at the DC Collectibles, Arkham Origins, Joker as Red Hood, Copperhead, and Deathstroke. In terms of packaging, you're not going to get a lot. It does have the 75th anniversary logo in the top there, but otherwise it's the, the standard, pretty plain Batman Arkham Origins pack. And on the back of the box we see the other figures that uh, come in the wave. I'll try and bring you a review on all of these guys. They're pretty cool figures. And then we see down the bottom some more as well. So let's get these guys open and take a look. So although it wasn't the best Batman game by any stretch, they've certainly done a good job of making some decent figures. And one of the things I love most about Batman is it has a great rogues gallery. Copperhead looks really cool. Red Hood and Deathstroke. We'll start by taking a look at Deathstroke. Very nice, well-detailed figure. They also released this guy with his mask, which also looks pretty cool as well. Next here we've got Red Hood. Not a lot to say about him. There's not a lot going on. Uh, the hood isn't removable. His arms are on a swivel, so the, the movement's a little bit limited as well. But uh, nicely detailed, and I suppose it's a good display piece. And last but not least, we have Copperhead, probably my favourite boss from Arkham Origins, and probably my favourite figure in this set. Lots of nice details. You can see the claws on her hands. Their nice tattoo on the front. Lots of great detail. A very, very nice figure. So I hope you enjoyed taking a look at this set.